I'm Karen Gillingham and I'm the director of A Trip to the Moon. The piece is about accepting difference in each other. So the astronauts arrive on the moon and there's a community of moon people that live there and they're very, very suspicious of each other and they're, they're suspicious of difference. And actually, ultimately, once they accept each other, they really do manage to um, you know, combat a danger, a force. And I think at the moment that feels really, really relevant and certainly to the company of performers that are in it, the kind of conversations we are having out of just that as a theme has been really fascinating and interesting and important. So we have a wonderful company of about 230 performers, starting it with our infant company who are from two local primary schools. So we rehearse in school time and they are a group of sort of five and six year olds who are the youngest moon children. Then we have, of course, our youth opera company. So they range from age nine to probably around about 21 years old. We've got a junior and senior company. There's about 95 of them. Then we have our in-school primary school company. So the idea with that group is that we rehearse in school time just to sort of reduce any barriers to being involved. And there are about 30 of them. And then we have a wonderful adult community company of 60 adults from all walks of life who've come together to share in this experience. And then um, some professional opera singers. Trip to the Moon will allow you just to absorb yourself in um, a world that's created by Andrew Norman, the composer of, he's created his own language of Moonish. And I think it's really great. It's like looking at a painting and thinking, what does it mean to you? And I don't mean that it won't make sense because it will, it's obvious what's happening. The astronomers have landed on the moon and the moon people are very suspicious, but they show their emotions in a different way to humans. So we've, re we've worked with this amazing choreographer, Natasha Kamjani, and it's things like, when you feel scared, what do you do? And there's this, they've all got these amazing moon sticks. Some of them are like boom whackers, they're tuned and they sort of feel scared by doing this, for example, whereas we might say scared is like this. So we've had quite a lot of fun of exploring movements through emotions. Um, so I think it's, it's the sort of piece that literally is for any age and it's a really, really good way just to enjoy watching um you know a work of art really with some incredible performers in it who are just you know fantastic to work with